my dear students as we are discussing something very important about interview preparation there are a number of things which come as a part of interview preparation so one and a most important thing is to consider about duties and responsibilities keep this thing in mind these duties and responsibilities are the major duties and responsibilities need to be organized by an applicant in the organization so who is responsible to develop these duties and responsibilities most of the time job analyst job analysts are spe typically hr specialist typically it need to be hr specialist but anyone who is expert in that particular job can be a job analyst so job analyst should make it a point to spend time in department where opening exists because job analysts are the part of an hr department and it is the responsibility of an hr department and it is the responsibility of job analysts to spend time in each and every department to observe different kinds of major duties or responsibilities played at any particular job position so this cannot be possible only by spending time over there if you will spend time over there and you would conversate with the line manager about that particular job positions then you would be able to define the major jobs or responsibilities of that position otherwise if you would sit in your office in your desk and you would try to get some major duties or responsibilities about that job from a internet obviously you would not be able to understand the real context and you would develop the duties and responsibilities which are fake or which are not real and which are not really relevant to that particular job position and it would create a lot of trouble in the interviewing process and it would lead to hiring of an individual which are not quite much relevant to that particular job position so this point of defining jobs duties and responsibilities is very critical as a part of a job analysis so observing and conversing with incumbents is very important as they perform various aspects of the job as well as talking with the supervisors who is supervising that particular position is very much important so two things you have to conversate with the incumbents who already served on that particular position and you have to talk with the supervisors as well because supervisors know very well supervisor can tell you the things in depth that what kind of a major duties and responsibilities are more commonly related to that particular job position so it would help you to understand the perspective of the scope of the work involved for that particular position in reviewing the duties and responsibilities of an opening job analyst will want to determine if they are realistic in relation to other factors such as previous experience or education my dear student it is very much important to relate the job duties and responsibilities with the previous experience and education of the person so you need to be very realistic you need to consider all the factors which are very much important to accomplish the major duties and responsibilities of that particular job so job analysts need to determine the realistic factors which were involved in defining those jobs duties and responsibilities and most relevant thing is the job experience and the ex education to perform the tasks which are involved in any particular job so job analyst should review the duties and responsibilities of job each time a position becomes available my dear students sometime it happened that company develop job duties and responsibilities of any particular job position and then for years even for decades they are not going to change that duties and responsibilities thing they are don't go go far change in the job description of that particular position so my humble suggestion to all to you all that whenever the position open you have to review the job duties and responsibilities because because due to some important contextual factors there are some important changes can be happened in that particular job and it is very much important to incorporate all those changes which may happen during that particular period of time so whenever you have to open the position whenever you have to announce a position for as a part of an interview preparation you need to review the major duties and responsibilities of that particular job and most relevant question you need to ask during the interview even if an opening was filled 6 months ago and is now vacant again assessing its current status will ensure that no major changes have occurred in the interim 
because sometime in the interim period some major changes can be occurred some reporting relationship can be changed some contextual factors may be involved so it is your responsibility as a job analyst it is a responsibility as an interviewer before interview preparation you need to consider these major duties responsibilities of each job in a very great way 